Hey guys, Brendan Fry here, coming to you from the park. As I say, if you can work from anywhere, then you should be doing it, right? So today I want to talk to you about how to respond to prospects when they say they don't have any money to join your business. All right, a lot of the times they do have the money to join your business. They're just not telling you, okay? Um, now, there's going to be a small section of people who really don't have the money and they may not have the means of, of getting the money. Maybe they, they have poor credit and they can't even get a loan. Um, but a lot of the times people can either get the money or they already have the money. They're just not letting you know. So here's a cool little scenario you can play out, a little um, uh, marketing tool for you you can use when you're talking to prospects, all right? So let's say you're talking to Bob. You've done a really good job of recruiting Bob um, so far. You've found out his why, why he wants to get into the business, what does he hope to gain from joining your business opportunity. And we're going to use that, not against him, but we're going to use that to help him understand that, um, that he does have the money, okay? So let's say Bob really wants a new home. He's uh, wanting to get into this business, and in the next year or two, he's hoping to purchase a new home for his family, all right? That's a reasonable why, and we'll say that's what it is. So let's say we're talking to Bob, and Bob's all gung-ho. He's ready to join and everything, but he says, you know what, I just don't have the, uh, the money right now to get in to buy the products and all that. Well, what I would say is, well, Bob, what if I could get you that brand new home next week? Then would you be able to find the money to get into my business today? Likely, Bob's going to say, well, yeah, of course I could, I could find the money if I can get, knew I was getting that house next week. And so then what I would point out is, well, well great, so you do have the money, um, but obviously I did something wrong because you don't sound like you have the belief in our business like I thought you did. Uh, maybe we should take a step back and go back over the business a little bit and find out if there, there's something I missed. Uh, maybe your belief just isn't there yet. Um, and we'll go from there. Now, uh, another thing you could do is offer a solution to, to that problem. And there's a, I don't know, hundreds of different lending websites out there now that offer loans um, that are backed by investors and stuff. So it's very easy to get approved for a loan online now. Some of them have high interest rates. But if somebody gets in the business, they work hard, they can pay that off really quick. I've actually had members join my businesses and um, they paid those off almost immediately just because they they uh, got into high ticket, a high ticket program, got the money back, and paid it off immediately. That way, they didn't have to deal with all that interest. All right. So, um, but the whole point of that little exercise there is to point out that money is not the issue. It's their belief that really is the issue. You know, unfortunately, our society is interested in instant gratification. You know, with everything nowadays, and you know, making money is no different. So when, and unfortunately. People look at network marketing or MLM, uh, these type of business opportunities, they look at them, at them as like lottery tickets. You know, I've had guys I've had to turn away before who said, Brendan, I want to get into your business. I'm looking to pay my rent. It's coming up in the next couple of weeks and I don't have any money, but I've got enough money to get in your business. I'll turn them away because this is not a quick get out of jail free card or anything like that. This is a, a real business that you're going to have to put some work into. And it's not meant to get you out of debt uh, really fast, or it's not meant to dig you out of some financial hole you've gotten yourself into. It's really uh, to create a long-term success for your future. And so I try to make sure that people are um, using it in that way. All right, uh, hopefully I won't have to ask these people for uh, rights to put them in my video. <laughs> um, but anyway, guys, uh, so that's kind of how I handle it. You know, I'll ask somebody, um, you know, what if I could, get, if it's a new Corvette they're hoping to get you know, by joining our business, I'll say, well, what if I can get you that new Corvette tomorrow? Then would you have the money? Or then could you find the money, borrow the money from your aunt, uncle, whoever, to get into the business? And likely they'll say, well, yeah, yeah, of course I could. So typically it's not a money problem. It's really a belief problem. So I'll, I'll just take a step back and say, all right, well, Let's figure out where I went wrong because obviously I didn't explain this right or obviously I didn't share all the testimonials of my team and what we've done so far. You know, when I tell them, you know, my teams have done millions of dollars in commissions, you know, their belief should be pretty much null and void. I mean, their, I mean, their belief should be there and all of this belief should be null and void. So, um, guys, that's just kind of how I handle it and I hope that helps you out. Um, if you've been on the fence, maybe, you, uh, maybe you've been thinking about joining me or somebody else in a network marketing business. And maybe you've been the one that said, uh, I don't have the money. Maybe you can rethink that and, and think real hard if you really wanted it, if you really wanted that success. Because I'll tell you, the biggest struggle with network marketers anyway, and probably most entrepreneurs, they talk, them out of, they talk themselves out of success 
faster than anybody else will. You know, faster than anybody else will. They keep themselves from success more than anybody else will. All right. So, uh, guys, I hope that helps you out. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below or just reach out to me. Otherwise, guys, I'm going to get back to enjoying this nice day, and I'll see you on the next video. Have a good one, guys.